What is cryosurgery? Cervical cryosurgery, or cryotherapy, is a gynecological treatment that freezes a section of a woman's cervix. Cryotherapy uses special instruments called cryoprobes that deliver liquid nitrogen. It is most often done to destroy abnormal cervical cells that are precancerous, which your doctor will refer to as cervical dysplasia, and is over 85% effective. Cryosurgery is usually done after a colposcopy confirms the presence of any abnormal cervical cells. Cryotherapy is also used for the treatment of cervicitis or inflammation of the cervix and abnormal bleeding. Cryotherapy is not a treatment for cervical cancer. What happens during cryosurgery? Cryosurgery is an office procedure that is done while you are awake. After undressing from the waist down, you will be asked to lie with your feet in stirrups. A metal speculum is then inserted into your vaginal canal so that it can be held open to allow for a view of your cervix. A cryoprobe is then inserted into your vagina and placed firmly on the surface of your cervix, covering the abnormal tissue. Liquid nitrogen then begins to flow out of the cryoprobe at approximately negative 50 degrees Celsius. The cryoprobe becomes cold enough to freeze and destroy the abnormal cervical tissue. For optimal treatment and the best results, the freezing is done for three minutes. The doctor will let your cervix thaw and then repeat the treatment for three more minutes. Although some slight cramping may occur, cryosurgery is relatively painless and produces very little scarring. What can I expect after cryosurgery? Almost all normal activity can be resumed immediately after surgery. It is normal to experience a watery discharge for the first few weeks following the procedure, which is caused by the shedding of the dead cervical tissue. Do not use tampons or douches and no vaginal intercourse for at least two to three weeks. If you experience any fever, heavy vaginal bleeding, severe or increased pelvic pain, or foul smelling yellowish discharge, please call your doctor immediately at professional gynecological services. Cryotherapy is relatively risk free. After cryosurgery, you will be required to have a pap test done every three to six months for a period of time to ensure the surgery was successful. Once you have had your several normal pap smears, your doctor at Professional Gynecological Services will discuss how often you should come in for a screening in the future.